playmaking guard, obviously point guard, but also the ability to score. And I would look for him to, he always is looking to attack, Ted. But tonight, I bet you early, he's got that in his mind to get back on that right track. Inside. Rebounding team. Only out rebound at K-State by three. So they, I don't think they have to win the rebound. Easier said than done, though, right? All right, and then that's the story all year for Kansas State. Can they flex Mark Smith and shake your head? Well, it was Pack early in the half carrying them. Now it's Smith. Smith able to just use that big body to continue to get easy looks. I mean, he's obviously a good athlete, but he just gets his space. And right there, easy one. You know, Scott Drew, you know, talked about his, you know, his desire, interest to be a, a pediatrician it comes from just the kind of person that he is, you know, wanting to take care of others. Good. Yeah. So the layup for Pack, he's got 25, his sixth 20-point game in Big 12 play. Flagler underneath. Chubb, what? He just has tremendous feel right there. Rejects the ball screen because he had the lane straight line down that left-hand side. Starting to feel like when he had 35 against Kansas. Ted, he's only played 16 minutes tonight. He has not scored. The girl hasn't gotten going. He's got two points. It's typically one of those two guys that complements Smith and Pack, and they have not gotten that tonight. They had four in double figures in the win over TCU on Saturday. Just two in double digits tonight. Chama Chachua. And uh, softly get it to go. Drew says that Chama Chachua has made such strides in terms of his basketball IQ and his skill level. We've seen it this season. Now the